Now, today's top stories and Power of 5 weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Good morning, I'm Katie Houston. And I'm Danita Harris. Here's a look at your top local stories. The race for Cleveland's new mayor has gone from a field of seven candidates to two. Heading into the general election on November 2nd is Democrat versus Democrat. Businessman and community leader Justin Bibb got about 26% of the vote, while current council president Kevin Kelly received just under 20%. Both candidates say they're focused on moving forward. And it was a historic night in Cleveland Heights. That city voting for its first mayor in 100 years after deciding to move away from a city manager system back in 2019. Right now, the top two candidates moving on. Barbara Danforth leading with 46% of the vote, followed by Khalil Sarin with 38% of the vote. Melody Joy Hart coming in third with 15%. And today is the deadline for the committee tasked with redrawing Ohio's legislative district map. If Ohio's redistricting commission doesn't get support from both sides on a new 10-year map for the State House and Senate, they can still move ahead with new maps for four years, then redraw the districts again. Ohio's congressional maps are also being redrawn. Lawmakers face a deadline of September 30th. Let's get a check on our weather for today. How's it looking on a Wednesday? Well, we're still tracking some rain, maybe some thunderstorms for this afternoon. This front still trying to roll through, but I mean, look at the cooler air that's going to try to settle on in here. I mean, 50s north, northwest of us we will be in the 50s by Thursday morning. I think today the northwest winds take over and try to dry things out and uh, really definitely just keep us on the cool side. Upper 60s, low 70s all day, but we got to watch for a couple more storms that may try to pop up this afternoon. I'll show you those coming up. Stick around. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.